Hi everyone, it's Expense and I've got more facts for you. When James Cameron was a wannabe director, he sold the scripts for the Terminator for just one dollar. So the movie could actually be made. Um, at this time, nobody knew who James Cameron was. Um, and it was the only way he could get the movie financed. Um, it turns out that the Terminator went to gross £37 million. Pounds. Pablo Escobar, he's famous for many reasons, but an odd reason that he's famous is he introduced hippopotamuses to Colombia. Um, at first, they were part of his private collection, um, but after his untimely death, um, they escaped from his zoo and they are now wild in the waterways of Colombia. There's an estimated 120 individuals at the moment. Mars and Earth have an average distance apart of 196 million kilometres, or 122 million miles. Um, as neither are on a purely spherical orbit, this can change. Um, the minimum distance is 33.9 million miles, which happens every few years. And that is why there's three Mars missions you've probably heard of in the news that are arriving during February. Um, the next Mars close approach will be in 2022. This is when we hope to get samples of Martian rock back to Earth. Uh, Mike Tyson admitted that one time in the 80s he offered a zoo attendant $10,000 um, so he could fight a silverback gorilla. Uh, Tyson claims the gorilla was being a bit of a bully to the other gorillas in the enclosure and he just wanted to fight him. Um, the zoo attendant declined the kind offer. In 2016, Nigeria's government fired 24,000 workers for not existing. Um, they were purely made up people on payroll. Um, the mass firing of these non-people saved the Nigerian government eight million pounds per month. Point Nemo in the Pacific Ocean is the furthest place from any land on Earth. It is approximately 1,670 miles from Ducey Island. If you were to be at this point alone at the right time, your nearest human beings would be on the International Space Station. Um, crows, they're intelligent birds and they can hold a grudge. If you were to repeatedly be mean to an individual crow, say chase it away from food or just throw sticks at it, um, it would remember your face and it wouldn't just be grumpy with you by itself. It would teach every other crow it knows, including its baby crows, to hate you. Anyway, that's today's fact. I'll see you tomorrow for more facts.